has failed me for the last time. And we're back with another Star Wars Force Arena video. Now, this game is currently out in limited release in Australia. So if you want to learn how to download it on iOS, you can click up here in the top right hand corner and there's a video so that you can get the game early. There is no global release date out on it yet and I don't really know how to download it on Android or Google. I understand that there's something called APK or something like that. And this game is kind of like a cross between League of Legends and Clash Royale. If you've played Clash Royale, it'll seem very similar. So I'm gonna open up this pack. It took eight hours to unlock and let's see what we get inside of that. And I've been focusing on the dark side. Oh, I need lots of that gold. I need those guys, boy. Oh, those guys can snipe like the turrets. They don't attack the ground troops. All right, let's see what I can upgrade. Uh, looks like I can upgrade this guy. No, nope. I have been focusing only on dark side. I'm just kind of ignoring the light side. And I'll tell you why. This is why. <laughs> I just think that's why the only reason why I would play Palpatine is because I think that is hysterical. Look at his face right here. <laughs> he looks like a clown or something like, like sadistic glee or something like that. We got to do it one more time. Let's get a close up of it. <laughs> uh, lots of cool stuff. Uh, one of the main things that I noticed here is that there's basically there's a hero. You start off with the hero and at the beginning you can get these four. So I, they give them to you for free. So you got Bosk, Palpatine, Leia, and Luke Skywalker. And one of the cool things I noticed is that they have Ezra Bridger. And I've been watching this show, Rebels, which is out on Disney. I'm about three quarters of the way of season two. That's a really cool series. It kind of takes place after the Clone Wars, before the current movie that's coming out, Rogue One. So there's a lot of heroes in the series like Ahsoka and Darth Vader and Rex is in it. But Ezra is pretty much the main hero in it. And he's kind of like a, a Luke Skywalker type of character. He's force sensitive. He's very strong. And it's kind of cool to see that type of person in the game. So I've been using Palpatine and pretty much I'm at the beginning of the game. So I can only use these troops and I'm having difficulty understanding what all of them are, but this guy here is awesome. He's a tank. He has a lot of hit points. This guy right here can shoot the towers only, So, and he has long range, but he's very easy to kill. And then a lot of these other ones right here, like this, this is a melee. This guy here does splash damage. This guy is just like a generic trooper. And then there's this, which... Um, hits the ground and everybody dies. I'll just show you. And as far as the strategy goes, I haven't figured it out yet. I, I really haven't. But there's two lanes and you have basically a turret on each lane and then one in the middle and then your main base. And then you can move around and place units on the ground and try to destroy their base. And the only strategy that I can figure out is kind of to save up the energy because there's gonna be cards over here on the bottom right. And you can drag the cards and place them on the ground. And you can see my energy is building. I've got seven. And then I can see the map. And it looks like they're pushing down this side. So what I'm going to do is get behind my turret. I'm going to drop that guy in the front, that guy there, that guy right there. And then I'm going to, if I can get my tie to come out, then I will do that. All right. It looks like I'm ahead on this a little bit. All right, this is a good push right here. Let's drop my big tank. Uh-oh, ouch, he dropped his uh, X-wing on me. All right, we got rid of that. All right, now let's see if we can push this a little bit further. Let's drop that guy in the back because he does rocket launcher. I think I can take this tower right here. All right, as soon as I do, I'm gonna back out. Cool, it's done. All right, let's go get some health. And then I'm gonna save up my energy to get back to 10. Right now it's at six. And I will try to push on this side right here. Um, I've got my TIE Fighter, which is very useful in destroying mass amounts of troops. Okay, he's got a couple guys over here. I need to take care of this guy. Let's drop that. What is, I don't know what that, that, that thing is right there. Uh-oh. Let's see. Let's, uh, let's drop the TIE right here. 
Okay, take out all those units. All right. <laughs> I'm just scrambling. All right, I got this lane. This lane's good. And I think I want to save up the five energy for that. I think I want to... Uh, let's see. I'm looking at the mini map right now, and I can see that he's coming down this way. I think I want to go protect this tower. All right, not a problem. All right, so we're going to push this lane up here. And what's, uh, oh, something's going on over here. I'm going to come, I, I don't want to lose this. Uh-oh, let's drop that. Oh, no, he got my turret. Oh, no. Okay, let's see. I have, um, let's drop the heavy gunner and the melee unit. Turret destroyed. Cool. All right, when I get, I, I'm scrambling. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> All right. Oh, he's behind me. Let's see if we can take him out. Come on. Chai, Jedi scum. Oh, no, no, no. I'm going to die. Oh, actually, I survived. I, I thought he died. Okay, we both died, so that's okay. What is at my base? Who's at my base attacking? All right. The score is two to one. Nine seconds left. I think I won this one here. Okay, let's uh, just protect this. I didn't do my... Let's do the tie strike right here down the middle. Let's see how many of those guys I wipe out. Sweet. <laughs> I don't have it figured out yet. Okay, so I win a battle, and I'll get a card. And I get a bronze pack, tier one. I am in tier one. When I get to tier two, better things will show up in there. Let's go into my rewards and I need to start opening one of these packs. It takes three hours to unlock. And then this free pack here at the bottom right, you get to open up every hour or th about every three hours or so. And then the play pack on the top, you have to get like 10 points through battles. I guess you get anywhere from one to four points. I think four, you can get up to four. And then you get a bunch of stuff there. Right now, I'm pretty much restricted to using the tier one units. Let's go into the decks, at which are right here. But as I get up higher in tiers, I will discover more cards. And it looks like some of the units are specific to your hero. So I'm like using Palpatine, and Palpatine can use the Royal Guards only, and then so on. Looks like that's only there for Tarth Vader. I can't wait to get Boba Fett. Dengar, and then Darth Vader, and then on the light side, there's Lando, Han Solo, and then the one that I'm excited about is Ezra. Just cool to see him in a game. I really like that Rebel series. Let's do one more, because I, I think I got lucky there with that win. My card slots are full, but like in Clash Royale, that doesn't really matter if it's full. It seems like they come in order anyways, whether or not you get them or not, you can't really cheat it. Uh, if I was able to move up to Tier 2, that would be different. And then I would want to make sure I'm getting packs in Tier 2. But right now, I'm at the beginning stages of the game. Ooh, we're going to go up against Ezra. And I'm not really even sure what all the legendary heroes do and their specialties. All right, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to kind of wait until I get to 10 energy and just try to see what lane he goes down. He looks like he's going on the bottom lane, so I'm going to move over here. Oh, and he's doing the same thing. Oh, he's just attacking the base. All right, well, I'm going to drop some units here. Let's drop the tie. Oh, well, now we can push. All right, so we kind of waited. And let's see if we can take this turret right here. Let's drop that. Oh, he's already up and running. Boy, he got back to life fast. Oh, I died. Oh, and he's going down both lanes now. Uh-oh. Please don't take a tower. Uh, I'm going to have to run. Okay, leader defeated. Let's go to the top tower. Let's at least drop. Uh, that's a rocket trooper. That won't help me. That guy there. And let's go bottom lane. All right, cool. Um, he's going top. All right, let's, uh, let's push top here. Let's get some health first. This, the tank is really strong. Oh, don't... Okay, cool. Now I should have a good push. Uh, let's do that. Heavy gunner. No! He got my turret! 
All right, let's drop the rocket trooper in the back. And this should chain lightning. Oh, I didn't hit all five. All right, I think I got this tower. Between all these guys, I should be able to do it. Um, that is almost dead. Cool. Okay, I'm going to get out of there. We need to go check out what's going down here at the bottom. One to one right now. All right, he has a push on both sides. Let's just drop that. Oh, let's get some health. A little health pack there. Uh, let's go take care of these guys up here. Let's see. Leader defeated. Okay, well, let's just drop a stormtrooper off right there. Uh-oh. Oh, I think I've got the auto dispatch thing on. I need to turn that off. Um... All right, and let's drop him. Uh-oh. Oh, let's get out of here. Please survive. No, we both died. Um, it looks like I'm looking at the mini-map right there. It looks like I do have units going up at the top, so that's good. Uh-oh. He's going to take the second tower. Please don't go. All right. All right. I'm not using this card right here down at the bottom, the rocket trooper. Let's uh, do that. Cool. How did they get all the way to my base? One to one. All right. I don't think. I think this is going to be a draw. Sudden death. Okay. Well, let's do it. All right. I think I got this. Come on. Let's lightning these guys. Okay. Come on. Let's push this tower. I think I got this. Woohoo! <laughs> Oh, boy. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm having fun. All right. Well, I got to 78, whatever that is. I think I got a lot of work to do. Let me know what you think of this game. I'm liking it. Now, like I said, it's only out in Australia. So this is kind of like a early release beta. I'm sure they'll make modifications to it as it goes forward and gets launched globally. And the question that was asked to me is if I play in Australia iTunes will it transfer to when it goes globally. This game is made by Netmarble and I did this on another game that they had where I played in the beta in the pre-release and it was linked to my Game Center account and or Facebook and everything did transfer over when the game went globally. And as always, thanks for watching and keep on gaming.